I'm Alex and I'm playing Harkin uh, and he is, he is the miser. He doesn't give much away, um, literally. He's full of schemes to, to make himself richer, um, uh, usually at everyone else's expense. It's his sort of money-making schemes that, uh, that land everyone, including himself, in, uh, in trouble. Um, I'm Eliza Collins and I'm playing for a scene. Uh, she's a uh, sort of wheeler dealer con artist slash matchmaker, really. Uh, and I'm Ed and I'm playing um, Maitre Jacques, who is one of Harpagon's servants. Uh, and Jacques is a very, is a, as you can imagine, being his servant, ex incredibly put upon, incredibly poor, and sort of gets more and more and more bitter about this as the play goes on until finally it blows up. I'm Helen Sorin. Uh, I'm going to be playing Elise in The Miser. Uh, and Elise is the daughter of The Miser. She is um, very hard done by. Um, she's deeply, deeply in love with um, Valère. My name's Daniel Wilde. I'm playing Valère and La Flèche. Uh, Valère is um, he's a character who's born into money, but he's pretending to be poor so he can work in Harpagan's house and be close to the woman he loves, with hilarious consequences. My name's Ben Ashton, and I'm playing Cleot, who's the son of Harpagon, and he he wants to be his own man, really. He He's desperately in need of money, um, so he can go off and be the man who he wants to be and be a hero and marry this beautiful lady here. <laughs> I'm Charlie Russell. I'm playing Marianne, who um, is in love with Cleant. But uh, she's the sort of sweet, innocent damsel in distress. Um, it's caught up in, in the mess of everything, really, and she's trying to, trying to be okay, but she desperately wants to love everyone <laughs> and have everyone love her. Yeah, it's about a guy's complete obsession with money and having it there um, but not, not spending it um, and I think that's quite relevant obviously with the banks and their issues at the moment and that there's so much money there um, but he doesn't know what to do with it. I think we're working off a great translation. Martin Sherman's done a fantastic job and it's, he's really brought it up to date and mm -hmm. the story is most kind of classic stories is timeless. There's a lot of Commedia dell'arte influences and clowning influences, um, which sort of suit the fact that I think the entire cast is so young. Um, relatively young. Relatively. <laughs> feeling old, Keep me together. Keep me together. <laughs> Keep me together. It's full of laughs. It's, we're, we're laughing constantly in rehearsals. <laughs> Nancy will start laughing and then we'll all start giggling. And... I don't know about you, I often find at the end of, end of the day my face is generally hurting. Yes, the job. Uh, from smiling so much. <laughs> <laughs> Which is a very nice way to work. Yes. Thank <laughs> you.